Hello and welcome to this new episode. I'm Morgan, intuitive personal development coach and energy reader. And today I want to talk about improving your life step by step for durable results. So I know when we are not fully happy or satisfied with where we are in life, we want results fast, okay? But the thing is, it doesn't have to take long, but it needs to take the time that it needs. So what I mean by that is that durable results take decision and commitment. And, you know, just to take the example of New Year resolution, you know, usually New Year resolution is just, okay, I'm going to do this and that. And then January 31st comes and, well, it's just a list of words on a piece of paper. So the, the reason why it's because usually we set big goals and there's nothing wrong with setting big goals. Don't get me wrong, on the contrary. But the key is to take it step by step. And also having support, having your own support and surrounding yourself with people who really want to see you succeed. And just to come back on the New Year resolution, usually the big goals, the big results are considered, but not the steps to reach these goals. So it's like you go from one year of not doing it to then January 1st, I'm setting this goal. But what about the action plan? You know, you need to be kind to yourself and not expect from yourself to reach the end result without taking it step by step. So it's a matter of being kind to yourself and setting realistic mini goals to reach your bigger goal. And it's okay if you feel discouraged sometimes. It happens. You're allowed to feel that way. As long as you acknowledge and shift the energy instead of staying in these energies, in these low vibrations of discouragement. And having an accountability partner who you trust and who really has your back can be helpful. Or working with a coach as well to really have this, uh, this empowerment, this celebration, you know, to support you when, you when you feel a little bit discouraged because we are all humans and it happens. So when you set a goal, especially if it's something that you consider as big, you know, very important for you, see the big picture, but break it down into different actionable steps. Just like when you have a plate of food in front of you, you don't eat the whole plate at once, you take small bites. That's the same idea. And change small things to create new habits. And it might seem like it's going to take you longer, but at the end of the day, it's actually faster because the results will show quicker. If you divide your big goal into smaller actionable steps, like I was saying, and you start creating new habits, then you will see results faster because you will, you will realize that you have shifted. And because you will start seeing results, you will be encouraged to keep going. And reaching the end goal in itself does not have to take longer than necessary. It just takes focus determination and clarity. Clarity on the next step. You don't have to be fully clear on the whole process yet. You just need to get started, stay focused, decided and committed. Working with a coach or a healing facilitator or whoever you feel can assist you on your journey is also a good way to accelerate this journey and really have a laser sharp focus and a precise idea on how to reach your goals and how to implement these steps because the coach in question, the professional in question, will have the outside perspective and the experience to accompany you, especially if it's an intuitive coach, for example, like myself, with the ability to to tap into the unseen and help you get, I don't want to say shortcut, because shortcut feels like you're going to miss some aspects. So it's not really shortcut, but yeah, acceleration and maybe hacks, 
you know, <laughs> to to fasten your your results, to really be focused and clear and have this accountability. So to summarize, I wanted to say set the big goal, divide it into actionable steps, create new habits, and you will get there faster than you'd think. So I hope that helps and uh, just one last word about feeling discouraged. Whatever lower vibrational emotion you are feeling, acknowledge the only way out is through and within. So go within yourself, acknowledge, shift, keep going. Of course, take the time you need to process, don't get me wrong, but what I mean is that don't stay in the low vibrations, you know. Don't doubt yourself, basically. So I hope that helps. I hope this gives you a little boost of confidence and whatever you want to achieve, you know you can do it. It's just a matter of getting it done and finding the strategy that works for you. So I'm wishing you all the best on your journey to reaching your goals and dreams. And I will see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.